Hi guys, this is Samantha from RefashionYourLife.com. You also recognize me as being a mentor and a marketeer within the home and online business industry. I want to talk to you about rehashing old relationships. Now, I can't say that I'm the person who's done everything right in life. In fact, that's why I built Refashion Your Life to begin with, is helping others to learn what I learned in the least amount of time and well, yeah, just to learn what I've learned in the least amount of time, really. And one of the lessons that I've gone through is, well, rehashing old relationships. Now, today, I just finished um, watching my dad do a butchering. And my dad, for years and years and years, has been a meat cutter. And he came to uh, Sundry, Alberta, which is where he lives now, and he opened up a butcher shop. Uh, it's called Carrick's Meats, it's in Old Alberta, and one of the things that he does is butchering. Now, I've secluded myself from my family for about six years, and I'm really taking this opportunity to get to know my family, and this is a big thing with business, because bus um, in the network marketing, in marketing in general, it's all about self-development, and success is all about being as whole as you can be. Now, if you think that me going and watching my father uh, do a butchering thing is, you know, is on the most enlightenment to-do list, it's not necessarily true. But getting involved in someone else's interests, in the person's interests who you're trying to rehash with to the person that you're trying to recreate that relationship with, is a big thing. It's a big deal. Just showing your interest in other people is a big deal. So I did this as a bonding experience to get to know him, to get to know his work. And it's actually quite amazing because my father is a great entrepreneur. He started um, his career as a grocery store and he was just the meat cutter in there. And then he bought his own grocery store and he, and he just moved up and up and up and up. He is amazing. He's an amazing gentleman. Um, and I've always, always aspired from my father. Um, so... As I'm sitting here and I'm watching what he's doing, I'm thinking about the business opportunities that he's he's doing with this. It's it's almost quite magical. He takes this this thing, he takes this thing that's been raised by someone else. He comes, he helps the transition process, and then he turns it into food on the table. It's quite an amazing process when you think about it. So anyways, the lesson of the day is you really, really want to see where other people are coming from, and if you want to be successful in this business, in this industry, you want to take the time to get to know yourself, and really, um, what's the word that I'm looking for? Uh, not save, but you really want to, um, uh, shoot heal those relationships that you have let fall away in the past because really the people that have hurt you are the people that you want to really have that uh, have that healing with and you want to be as whole as you possibly can be to be successful in this business so that's my tip of the day really take the time see where you're at acknowledge the people that may have hurt you and maybe just maybe now is the time to heal those relationships Thanks, guys. This is Samantha from RefashionYourLife.com, and I will talk to you soon.